Hey there, little kitty. I overheard something fascinating today. Your teacher said you wanted to be a Barbie doll when you grow up. <laughs> Barbie school. Absolutely. Barbie dolls are like magical friends who can be anything they dream of. But you know what's even more magical? The story of how Barbie came to life. Sure. So in today's episode, get ready to enter the Barbie world to discover the invention of Barbie dolls. Let's zoom in. Once upon a time, in the bustling city of Los Angeles, during the 1950s, a creative and forward-thinking woman named Ruth Handler observed her daughter playing with paper dolls. To her amazement, little Barbara often assigned these innocent toys adult roles, despite their representation of children. Seeing this, an idea sparked in Ruth's mind. Why not create a doll that embodied the aspirations of young girls, one that represented a strong and empowered adult figure? She decided to share her unconventional idea with her husband, Elliot, who was the co-founder of the renowned Mattel toy company. However, he wasn't entirely convinced that such a doll would find success in the market. Even the directors at Mattel shared the same sentiment, uncertain about the potential of this unexplored concept. But Ruth's determination knew no bounds, as her mind kept wondering about it all the time. And one day, when she was on a memorable vacation in Europe, Ruth stumbled upon a sophisticated toy doll called Build Lily. This doll was initially intended for adults, but it gained unexpected popularity among children due to the vast array of dresses that could be purchased separately. This struck a chord with Ruth as it aligned closely with her vision for the doll she had in mind. So inspired by Bill Lily's allure, Ruth took it upon herself to reimagine and redefine the doll. Then with the help of the ingenious engineer Jack Ryan, the doll was transformed into a symbol of empowered womanhood. A doll that would be named after Ruth's very own daughter, Barbara. Thus, the iconic Barbie was born. Then in March 1959, at the American International Toy Fair, Barbie made her grand debut in front of an eager audience as blonde and as a brunette. She executed charm in a black and white zebra striped swimsuit with a chic top-knot ponytail adorning her head. Her clothes were masterfully designed by Mattel's fashion designer, Charlotte Johnson. The dolls themselves were skillfully crafted in Japan, while the intricate stitching of their fabulous outfits was lovingly done by Japanese home workers. The response to Barbie's unveiling was nothing short of extraordinary. In her first year, approximately 350,000 Barbie dolls flew off the shelves, making her an instant sensation in the world of toys. The look and design of the Barbie changed over time, and today Barbies are made in different types with different skin and hair colors and even different face sculpts. But what remains intact is her story which has taught us the power of imagination, determination and the courage to be whatever we want to be. Trivia time! Did you know the first Barbie dolls cost three dollars each? Also, by the time Barbie turned 50 in 2009, Mattel had sold more than one billion copies of the doll. It's sketching time! 
The sketch of the day goes to Aradhya Anup. Hope you had fun today. Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. I'm a puppy cat in the puppy dress. Recycle plastic. It's fantastic. Ha ha ha.